Hello and welcome once more to Red Gaming Tech. My name is Amata. Today is the 16th of April and this time I have um, some rather unfortunate news regarding 2K Australia as the guys behind Borderlands, the pre-sequel as well as of course numerous other titles have been closed down. Now Kotaku are actually the first to break the news according to an anonymous source and then 2K responded with a statement basically confirming the then rumour. And 2K had this to say, quote, We can confirm we have taken steps to begin the studio closure process for 2K Australia in order to better manage ongoing development costs while improving the working proximity of our creative teams. We are very grateful for the team's valuable contributions to numerous 2K projects and are working with affected staff to explore reassignment ex opportunities where possible. Now obviously this is very sad news for the entire company and obviously everybody working there, but it actually has another downside for the Australian games industry as 2K Australia was actually the last publisher backed AAA studio in the country which is going to be a rather big loss for Australia as a games industry as you can imagine. Now in the past when 2K have let people go or close studios or whatever they've been pretty good about helping staff find new jobs after closures say with the rational games but obviously it's a bit tricky to find jobs in Australia where obviously the gaming industry is perhaps not in its most healthy state However, the local trade body GDAA excuse me, is on the case and they're basically helping 2K Australia guys find new positions. So always good to see that they're getting a, getting a little bit of a helping hand. So there you have it. A real, real shame as Borderlands the pre-sequel is regarded by a lot of Borderlands fans as one of the best Borderlands games in the series. And obviously all that talent that made that game as well as all the other games it's contributed to like for example all three Bioshock games, the Bureau, XCOM Declassified and Tribes Vengeance and a few other bits. All that talent is now unfortunately being scattered to the four winds. Now hopefully all the staff affected can actually find new jobs elsewhere. It's a pretty big loss unfortunately but here's hoping that everybody finds new homes. Anyway, that's me done for this video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.